Hi guys and welcome to Drive Spark and today what we have with us is the MG Aster. Now this is not a road test review. We've already driven this car and the link of the review is in the description so you can go and check that out. But today we'll be talking about the top 5 features of the MG Aster. So starting off with the feature number 5 is the lighting unit. So you have this LED headlamp over here where you get an inverted L kind of a DRL that changes into the indicators. You also get a bi-functional LED projector headlamp high beam low beam all over here and you get these nine crystal uh, kind of uh, uh, elements in the headlamp that look really futuristic and it reflects and gives the headlamp and the front end a very futuristic look you also get the uh, fog lamp unit but that is surprisingly not an led unit that's an halogen and moving on to the rear end you will get an all led uh, tail lamp cluster that uh, enhances the rear end of the car and makes it look really really nice so the rest of the four features i will be sitting inside the car and telling you so let's quickly hop in and i'll tell you more about it so feature number four is the engine options that you get on the Astra. So you get two engine options. You get a 1.5 liter naturally aspirated petrol engine and you get a 1.3 liter turbo petrol engine. That is this what we are driving. So the turbo petrol engine produces 140 PS of power and 220 nm of peak torque. And the gearbox option that you get with this is a six speed automatic. And this is a really nice gearbox option. So feature number three is this massive panoramic sunroof that you see over here. Now to open the panoramic sunroof, to open the shade, there is a button. You just have to press this and the shade will open all the way up to the end as you can see right now. So once this is completely open, the passengers who are sitting at the rear will get a pleasant view of what's going on outside, especially during a monsoon or a rainy uh, day. And uh, to also open the sunroof, you have a dial. So either you can open the sunroof completely like this, and it will obviously go behind and you will have a lot of space over here. Now, if you want to adjust the sunroof and if you want to open it uh, like a little bit, so you have this dial over here, so you can just adjust the dial according to your need and the sunroof you can see it opens step by step and if you want to completely close it then you just revolve this dial and the sunroof closes back and to close the shade you will have to press this button so you press it and the shade will close so feature number two is this cool looking ai that's an artificial intelligence that you get over here so this uh, actually does a lot of things like it, it can move it can uh, so let me just uh, demonstrate one thing so if you say hello asta I am listening. Please, please open sunroof. So there you can see the AI has opened the sunroof and if you want it to close it back, then again, let it open completely. And then again, it will tell you jokes. You can ask it various questions. It will interact with you and it will make your journey really pleasant. So to close the sunroof again, you just have to say, hello, Asta. I'm here. Close sunroof. So no buttons you can completely go hands-free and that is how the sunroof will open and close and uh, you can also as i mentioned interact with it and do a lot of features so this is the artificial intelligence that the aster gets and it's a really really cool feature and coming to feature number one that is the adapt system that this car gets so it gets a level two adapt system in that you get a camera that is mounted over here so uh, this basically helps in the adaptive cruise control then you have a lane keep assist you have blind spot monitoring you have a, a, a pedestrian a collision warning you have rear end uh, collision warning so you basically this car is packed with features and obviously uh, over here that the button that you see over here so this is for your lane keep assist so if you press this and the lane keep assist will be activated so what will happen is that it will uh, take the markings on the road the white lines and the car will actually assist you while driving you can actually switch that off also and you can set uh, what uh, on what mode you wanted you wanted high you wanted low or you wanted medium so with this the mg aster is a pretty safe car and guys these were the top five features of the mg aster i hope you liked it if you liked it please give it a thumbs up share and subscribe to all our social media channels i'm from signing out see you next time thank you so much for watching take care be safe and drive safe